Good morning, everyone. Uh, winter in Wisconsin has not surrendered. Uh, my name is Mike Martin, and I want to welcome you to Unitarian Church North. It will be my honor and my pleasure to be your worship assistant this morning. I'm very glad to be introducing and welcoming our returning guest speaker today, Philip Chard. Uh, in addition to what you may already know or have read about Philip in today's order of service, I want to tell you that he's been a practicing psychotherapist for 30 plus years. And Philip, I apologize if that makes you sound long in the tooth. Um, <laughs> Philip is a licensed clinical social worker a master practitioner of neuro-linguistic programming. He is a certified hypnotherapist and a leader in the field of applied eco-psychology. He's very happy to be joining us here today and we're very happy that he accepted our invitation. Also assisting in the service today, we have Brittany on the piano as her accompanist and Mark in our song booth. It's very good to see everyone here this morning. To those of you who are visitors here for the first time, I want to thank you for being with us today. Welcome to this morning, this day, and this opportunity to be here together in community. UCN provides the light of religious freedom in the warmth of a caring community. All of us are welcome here, and all of us are loved. We welcome you to this common sacred place. Common because we are all welcome and sacred because here we transform the ordinary and attend to the profound. We carry with us into this space our regrets, doubts, fears, stories, laughter. May each of those inspire our worship. But above all, may each of us meet what we need most to find here today. All of us are imperfect, but we're here to drop our defenses and trust that what happens in worship is powerful and life-giving. Together, we affirm that this day and our being here together can make each of us braver, more compassionate, and wiser than when we woke up this morning. Again, welcome. In addition to our Sunday service, we invite you to become involved in the many different things that we have going on here at UCN. And if you have any questions, please feel free to see me after today's service. We have a staffed nursery that's available on our lower level for very young ones. And if you are here with little ones who become restless during the service, we also have at the back of the sanctuary a quiet room. It's equipped with speakers and windows so you can see and hear today's service as it goes on. We send announcements by email to church members and friends who have signed up to receive them in that fashion. But if you um, are not getting them that way and would like a copy, we have printed ones out in the lobby on the visitor's table. And again, there's much more uh, information available about UCN on our website. I'd like to uh, invite Lee up to the podium for a brief announcement. Brief? <laughs> yes, brief. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm Lee Huffteaser. I'm the Social Justice Committee chairperson, and I have a really exciting announcement. Back in January, the committee, uh, with the um, approval of the board, decided to sign up on as an in-kind sponsor of um, a racial justice program um, that is that was just approved on Friday by the Wisconsin Humanities Council for a, a grant. Um, so what's going to happen is we'll have a, a, a series of four films shown here um, with babysitting provided in the basement or you know, in the fellowship hall. And it's for, for children and adults uh, 10 years old and up. And the, here's a description. Um, Bridge the Divide and Nurturing Diversity Partners are the recipients of a Wisconsin Humanities Council grant. So our Come Meet the Family series will come to fruition. It is an anti-bias education effort to be offered in the predominantly white, affluent, and North Shore suburbs and exurbs to help people of goodwill there explore what they can do to counter the hate speech and action that have become more overt and prevalent in these times and expose themselves and their children to the lived experience of the targets of hate, build their awareness, empathy, and understanding 
in order to prepare their children for living in a more diverse world. Um, there's a lot of work to be done. We were hoping to start this on March 2nd, but turns out that the building is going to be rented out by somebody else all day. Um, it might, I'm working on trying to get something going this coming Saturday. Uh, they, will, they will all be on Saturday mornings, 9.30 to 11.30. Um, we will need help to provide some snacks and some volunteers to help guide people to, to the sanctuary. Um, so if you can help, please let me know afterwards. Thank you. Thank you, Lee. Uh, one other item that I want to point out to you are the multiple exits that we have here at UCN. Uh, to be here today, obviously, you entered the facility from either the upper or lower parking areas uh, via those set of doors. But I want to make note that in the event of some type of an emergency requiring evacuation, we do have additional exits. Here on the upper level, there is an exit door behind this wall. And there is a double set of wooden doors behind you in the upper lobby. On the lower level, there's an additional uh, exit door from the dining area that leads out into the playground area. After today's service, I hope that you'll join us downstairs on the lower level for conversation and a cup of coffee. And while you're there, I would encourage you to please check out the table that is set up there for script cards. That program is uh, a very important and essential role in funding uh, activities at our church. You'll find we have a number of instant cards for your favorite stores, restaurants, and gas stations. Being welcoming is important to us, and part of that spiritual practice is to provide a welcoming environment. So I'm going to invite you to continue with that important work by greeting those who are around you. And then when you hear Brittany begin the song, Gathered Here, which is printed in your order of service, Please wrap up your conversation and join us in that song. Thank you. <laughs> 